welcome to the Resources Roadhouse. I'm Wally Graham. I'm at the 2022 RIU Sydney Resources Roundup where I had a chat with Mike Dunbar, who's Managing Director of Mamba Exploration. Mike, uh, welcome to the Roadhouse. Good to see you. Yeah, it's great to see you too. Well, I haven't seen you for a long while, so it's yeah. been nice to see actually people in, in person again rather than <laughs> virtually on Zoom. So it's been nice to, nice to see is. you. It is, and, and uh, with a new outing for you, Mamba Exploration. So uh, it's one that we haven't come across or haven't chatted to you about um, uh, before. So um, it looks like you've got a few uh, gold projects over in WA. Uh, j j can you just walk us through? Look, absolutely. Um, so we listed in February of last year um, and based on four projects uh, and we're really targeting gold, nickel and copper um, in Western Australia. Um, so we've got four projects. Um, so if you look at the, the, the two areas we've, we've been most recently working on in, is in the southern area. So we've got the Darling Range and Kaliap Creek Gold um, projects. Kaliap Creek Gold and Darling Range is a, a jewel of look lookalike uh, just outside of Perth. So these are the, 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 the two projects we work in summer. Um, and we've got projects that we work in winter up, up, in, uh, up in the Kimberley where it's far easier to, to, to work in winter and when it's yeah, drier and, 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 yeah. and cooler rather than in summer when it's, what, when it's wet. So we've really been, we've got two very distinct project areas um, in the, a, a cricket season if you like and a, a, and a footy season full of, full of projects. So a little bit about the, the, the Caliot Creek um, and, and Copper Flats projects. I'll talk about in particular because that's really have been our focus. We, we are working on all of them, but they're, they're the two main ones of focus at this stage. So, at, moving to the Caliot Creek project, this is in the Great Southern of WA. Now, uh, what we've got there is we've identified from historical sampling and, and so on a, a four kilometre long soil anomaly. And the interesting thing about that, up to 2.8 grams per tonne um, in soils. So, we're not talking parts per billion, we're talking grams per tonne. And it's not just one sample, we've got multiple samples over a gram, uh, which define a, a, a four kilometre long soil anomaly. Uh, there's been historical drilling uh, at an area in the northern prospect and the central area in through here but no work had been, basically no work had been done here since the 1980s uh, at, at the southern prospect. So we went in there and did some drilling um, late last year and, and continued early this year. Uh, so far in the southern prospect the whole, the whole idea was to scope out the, the, the strike extent of it. So far we've identified it for 500 metres of the 32 holes we put into that into that target, 27 have come back with significant mineralisation. Now that's a that's a remarkable strike rate, but importantly, very shallow as well. Yeah. So we've only drilled down to around 35 metres vertically, and we've got drill intersections including things like 15 metres at 2.2 from one metre down hole. So you're not chasing things at depth. Um, you can chase. You, you can identify things very shallow in, in certain parts of, of WA, and that's where we're focusing. So we've had some very good intersections at, at, at the Southern Prospect. Um, that, con that area, we need to also do a lot of environmental studies and so on, we've done those. Uh, and we've got the next round of POW approved uh, and ready for, ready for drilling there when the winter rains abate. Yep. Um, and when we, when we can, uh, can get back in there, uh, probably in quarter four we'll be drilling there again. And the next phase will be to extend that 500 metres to a kilometre as well as start chasing it below 35 metres vertically. So yep. there's a lot of work to do there, but that's looking really exciting at this stage and, and really quite entertaining. And so the other one is the Copper Flats? Yeah, the Copper Flats is, is the other area, and that's, that's the, the project that we can work on in winter, because uh, up in the Kimberley, uh, far, far logistically difficult working in um, too much in the summer months yep. up there. So the Copper Flats is a very, very large project area. It's a, it's a sedimentary hosted uh, copper and silver system um, and we've identified some very, very high grade copper and silver um, mineralisation from surface sample in that area. So it's, it, it's right up against, in the East Kimberley, right up against the Northern Territory border which, which is literally right there. Oh yeah. Um, and we've identified a, a target horizon that extends for about 100 kilometres from, from the border all the way down towards Halls Creek. So a very, very large uh, terminate package. Um, and we've done some soil sampling and rock chip sampling in that area and have got results to confirm some historical results of up to 34% copper, which is remarkably high copper. But more, just as important as that is there's very high silver. Now the copper can be very mobile in the, in, in the weathered environment and so you've got to take it with a pinch of salt grades of up to 25-30% uh, copper at, from rock chip samples but the very high grade silver, up to 230 grams silver as well, which adds a lot of confidence that the system is real 
and the system's got some real potential because the silver is not nearly as mobile as the copper is. And so that really gives us some, some confidence yeah, that we've got a good broad indicator. something there. Yeah. We, we did some work there earlier on and then extended and, gr and grew the project further into the basin um, and have identified a number of other targets that we'll be doing geochem and geophysics on this field season. So we've been very, very busy in the area. So, so busy sounds like you, you have been busy and you're going to be even busier by the sound of it. Yeah, we are going to be. Uh, we're going to be busy ongoing because we've got yeah. the, this, this ability to work in summer and in winter. Yeah. $3.7 million in, in cash um, uh, at the moment, which is a fantastic position to be in. We don't need to raise any funds anytime soon, and we can really concentrate on what we're doing, which, yeah. is, which is a great position to be in. All right, well, um, uh, we'll look forward to uh, hearing about what you're up to. Make sure you stay in touch, and so we can uh, bring everything here to our, our viewers at the Roadhouse. But till then, it's been good to see you. Fantastic. Thanks, thanks very much, Molly. Good to see you as well. Cheers. Thank you.